I have a lot of people that come to me and they say, you know, hey, I wanna be able to make extra money outside of my job or things like that. Uh, because essentially that's what I've been able to do is figure out a way to leverage a certain skill set to be able to quit a job and be able to just be a business owner, entrepreneur full time, as opposed to constantly being an employee where I go to work and exchange my time for money, right? And a lot of people, they think that it's gonna be this easy path to success. And it's such a cliche saying that like business is not easy, but for some reason, it's just hard for people to get into their heads that no matter how much a person like myself or someone else that mentors them uh, is going to pour into them and be able to give them all the knowledge in the world, like you're still going to run into obstacles. You're still going to have hard times that come up. Everyone wants this smooth ride, including myself early on. I just wanted this smooth ride to the top. And, and when you actually get into the trenches and start going about this, you get punched in the mouth a lot. But the thing is, is that as you get better, you're able to overcome those obstacles much smoother and much easier and you make it look smooth. And that's why when people see someone like myself or someone else who's achieved a little bit of success or a lot of success, they think it was just always easy or that they were well gifted with, you know, something or, or that somehow they had some cheat code, right? And they're always looking for these cheat codes. You want to know what the real cheat code is? It's getting out of your comfort zone. Like we all live in this little sphere. I call it a sphere of influence, right? And in that sphere, you know, you go over here, uh, you know, every Friday you go um, hang out with friends or you go on a date night with your wife or, you know, for me, every Thursday I, I play in a golf league. Um, you know, you go to church here, you hang out with friends there, you go to eat at these five places. Like we're creatures of habit, right? We have this sphere of influence of the things, the people and the surroundings around us that influence our lives. And what you got to do and this is what people don't want to do, but what you got to do if you want to achieve success in, in a similar capacity that I've been able to, and I'm not uber, uber successful, I'm no millionaire yet, but I'm well on the way and with the way things are compounding, it'll be in a matter of you know a couple of months or, or maybe a year or so before I'm there. If you want to get there, you have to take that sphere and increase that sphere of influence, right? You gotta go start meeting different people. You gotta start going and doing different things. Get your body in a different shape. Talk to different people in a different way. Expand your skill sets, expand this this sphere of influence and get out of that comforting sphere that you're in, get out of that comfort zone. And that's how you're really able to start achieving different things in your life, right? There's that cliche saying that says, if you want something you've never had, you gotta do something you've never done. And that couldn't be more true. It's exactly that way. People expect to do the same things that they're currently doing and get a different and better result in whatever area of their life, whether it's health, wealth, relationships, anything, right? That's the biggest thing that I tell people is look, like it's gonna be uncomfortable. And then when they come to me and they're like, this is hard, I don't like this, like I want it to be easier. I'm like, look, if you can just get better at getting out of your comfort zone and being comfortable outside of your comfort zone, learn to train yourself to be comfortable outside of that, you know, initial small sphere of influence, you're going to be able to write your own ticket in life. You can achieve whatever amount of success in whatever area of your life that you want. I guarantee anybody that you see on social media, anybody that you see that has achieved any bit of success in their life or living their, what I call the goat life, right? The greatest life of all time. They have gone through severe, severe parts of their journey where they were totally uncomfortable. And the reason why they make it look so seamless and easy right now is because they have gotten comfortable with getting uncomfortable.